Welcome to Computer and Support. On this uh, short video tutorial, we're going to be showing you how to drop a, a simple piece of code in, well, piece of code into Windows PowerShell. The purpose of this is to show us what RAM you have in your system just now. Uh, perhaps you're looking at upgrading the RAM in your system. Uh, this piece of code is going to show us exactly what you have in there just now. It's going to show us the type of memory. It's going to show us the, uh, the amount of free slots that you have in there. Uh, and more importantly, it's going to show us what speed the RAM is you have just now. Uh, because if you're looking at upgrading the RAM in your system, then obviously the new RAM uh, has to match up with the speed of the, uh, the memory that you have in there just now. Some new laptop computers are incredibly difficult to get into uh, to find this information to get the RAM out. Um, so this is going to show us exactly what's in there, how many free slots there are. Um, and of course there is software that can do this, but it's not necessary. Just drop a piece, use Windows PowerShell uh, to just drop a piece of code in. Um, now the code you can find, if you're watching this on the Computron website, the code is just up there. Um, if you're watching this on, the, uh, on YouTube, uh, click the link just below uh, which will throw you over to the uh, the blog of uh, Computer and Supports and you can copy and paste the code directly from there. Okay, so let's get a look and see uh, how to drop this in. Uh, dead easy. First thing we do, uh, we're, uh, we're on the uh, the Windows, well this is the page that you're on just now or if, if you click the link, the code is here. Um, so within this page we're going to simply copy the code within this section here. Uh, so we're just going to click and select. Uh, we've selected all the uh, the code within here. Right click, copy. So that's on our clipboard now. We're going to launch Windows PowerShell as admin. To do that, right click on the start menu, take Windows PowerShell admin, uh, then hit yes to say yes you want to run that. Once, the, uh, once that's running, we've got uh, the PowerShell open here. On the keyboard, now we've got the code on our clipboard already, so on the keyboard we're simply going to press and hold Control and V to paste the code in and we're going to hit enter. Now on that, what this is showing us here in this particular computer that uh, I'm on just now, uh, it's going to show me here that I've got uh, uh, a module of RAM in bank 1 and bank 3. So there are four slots all together, two of them are used, um, the 16 gig RAM in there just now, uh, it's showing us that we've got 8 gig and an 8 gig, uh, there's the part number for them, and more importantly along here, 667, it's telling me that this RAM is DDR3. Um, so there we are, we, we know exactly what's in there, if I'm looking to upgrade, let's say step this up to 32 gig, uh, then I know that I'm looking to match it up as best as possible. Uh, I'm looking for uh, two 8 gig modules, um, DDR3667, um, and I've not uh, I've not lifted a screwdriver or installed any software uh, to find this information. So dead easy. Uh, so there we are. Thanks for watching. As always, you can subscribe to the Computer and YouTube channel. The usual, click the button and that type of thing. Uh, thanks for watching. That's all. Bye for now. Computroon on Facebook and online at www.computroon.co.uk.